The PNG Biomass project was fully acquired by Oil Search in 2016 and since then has gone ahead full steam with the planting of trees over a vast area in the Makam Plains. According to the project manager, stakeholder engagement, Jesse Mitter, the project is on track. Yeah, the infrastructure is there, it's so favourable weather to plant the species. So we've selected the two main species and one of the major ones is the eucalyptus pilita that's been planted out there. So we're looking at about um, around I mean, 20 million trees, but it's especially working with the communities. And um, An important aspect of the project has been the involvement of local landowners in various aspects of the project something which is core to the positive development so far. So we're looking at roughly around 6,000 people out in the valley. Um, we have what we class as Area A and Area B. So Area A is really um, starting from Arab to Laran. And we have two main communities, which is Zipasing and Taran communities. Then we have from Laron up to Waterai, so that's Area B. So it's actually two um, districts. I mean, what we do there is really engaging with the people, especially the, bringing the families together, bringing the communities together to engage, to work out there in the plantations, not just paying rentals to the, um, to the landowners, but having them to participate. And also, especially when you look at um, agriculture, because there's arable land out there, but we don't look at um, the land that is focused on their agriculture, but underutilized land where we plant trees, but they can also intercrop in between trees and plant um, food crops like watermelon, cucumbers, that has brought in substantial amount of money into their pockets and that's changed their livelihoods as well, especially for the mothers. The PNG Biomass project is supported through a 25-year power purchase agreement with PNG Power. Under the agreement, 30 megawatts of renewable energy will be supplied into the Ramu grid by the year 2020. And with increasing political focus on delivering cleaner energy, the PNG Biomass project looks certain to be a blueprint for further development of similar renewable energy projects into the future for Papua New Guinea. Just an example of how they can utilize these using those tools they can burn um, wood, boil the water and cook food, but also plug in the, um, the USB cables to charge their phones. And that's really some basic technology that we're also introducing into the community. Um, clean um, energy is important for us. So the main key thing is when it biomass plants trees, it's, it also sinks carbon, you know, so it's carbon neutral.